That boy T.I. Clifford Harris believes Young Thug is coming home really, really soon on a recent episode of The Breakfast Club. T.I. said, all we need to do is get Thug home. The rest will be handled. All the financial stuff will be handled. I love how Atlanta takes care of their own. For my Facebook listeners, T.I. said, I believe that once Young Thug is released from jail, this will be over and he will be fine financially because Atlanta's going to take care of their own, which is one of the things I always think is so dope about Atlanta. If you're in the club, you're in the club. And I always respected that. Y'all know T.I. one of my favorite rappers of all time. I, I, I do think what T.I. is saying about the state of Georgia versus Young Thug, you know, in this YSL Rico case has a lot of credence. If I'm being honest, the state looks ridiculous. And this is not a right or wrong or who I believe is a good person versus bad person. All that crap matters none. Legally speaking, which I'm not a lawyer, from what I've seen, which I watch a lot of this trial on the Law & Order YouTube channel, the state has not done a good job of making their case about Young Thug. I agree with T.I. That's all that matters in the court of law. Not what you think. Personally, none of that stuff matters. The state didn't do a good job of making a case. This thing looks like a mess. And I would be shocked the way it's heading right now if Young Thug, when it's over, doesn't countersue and sue the crap out of the state for saying, yo, y'all wasted my time. Y'all never had a case. This was all a bunch of baloney. Y'all cost me millions of dollars. And he's Young Thug, so it really would be probably $100 million. If the state doesn't at least clean their act up enough to save face from what I've seen, I believe they're going to end up being the ones. It's going to be YSL against the state of Georgia. And, and the state of Georgia is going to be on the defense if they don't clean their act up and at least save face with how poor that trial has went. Y'all let me know. If you've been following a little bit of the YSL Rico case, against the state obviously there have been a lot of plea deals made but for young thug specifically do you believe the state has done any any type of responsible job at making a case against him do you think he's coming home do you think he's gonna have to sit down for a few more years let me know your thoughts i think by the end of the year i think thug will be a free man i think christmas morning when jeffrey williams wakes up i believe he'll be doing it in the confines of his home that's what i think I'm out. If you are like me and love flexing your NBA knowledge, you should head over to the best place to play fantasy sports. That's Underdog Fantasy. For me, I love the pick'em game. It's super simple to play too. All you gotta do is go to the Underdog Fantasy website or app, pick whether a player will have a higher or lower stat line for that game, get all your picks right, and you can win up to 20 times your money. And when you sign up, if you use my code Ferro, your deposit will get doubled. You can't beat that. Again, head over to today's sponsor, Underdog Fantasy's website or app. Use my code FARO and your first deposit will get doubled. Do you want to see your favorite athlete live in action next time they're in your town? Or do you want to see your favorite artist performing in concert next time they're in a city near you? Head over to the SeatGeek website or app and use my code HOOPSFARO for $20 off your first purchase. Make sure you subscribe to the Is Mr. Telefero YouTube channel and hey, donate a super chat. Follow me on Facebook at Is Mr. Telefero, cop a supporter badge. The underdog fantasy promo code is Ferro. The Seat Geek promo code is Hoops Ferro. And follow me on Twitter at It's Mr. Ferro.